Oh no! Cage! Damn, I hate you! What's up, Space Cadets? This is KG48, and welcome back to my Let's Play for Imperion Galactic Survival. Alright, guys, so, on stream, oh boy, oh boy, guys, I died on stream, okay? I would have recorded it, but it just happened so fast, it was, you know, wham, bam, no thank you, ma'am, you know what I mean? Like, I just got hammered, and uh, it kind of sucked, but I, I've learned some lessons, and I lost some, I lost some loot. I lost some loot, okay? Uh, first of all, I lost my small vessel. Uh, my, um, yeah, my small vessel. Okay. And I also lost everything I had on me. Now, it wasn't really that bad. I mean, I lost, like, my tools, which I've, I've already replaced. Uh, I lost some ammo. Some little things here and there. It wasn't it wasn't too bad. It really wasn't too bad. Although, when it happened, I was, I was raging like a nut job. You know, because that's what I do. That's how I roll. All right. So I was going crazy, and um, I learned a valuable lesson. Okay. My first lesson. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna help you guys out here. I'm gonna do you solid. Okay. Because you guys can learn from my mistakes. All right. Number one. Don't take, don't take the difficulty of the game for granted. Okay. Um, and what I mean by taking the difficulty for granted is I made a, uh, a medical bay, like five videos ago. I maybe not five videos ago. I don't know how many videos ago. I made a medical bay a long, long time ago. Okay. And I, through my hubris and through my arrogance of thinking, you know, I wasn't going to die, I never put the damn thing down. Okay, so when I respawned on stream, um, yeah, I respawned, like, out in, like, the middle of nowhere. Is this already all gone? This thing, this is all gone? Wow. That didn't take that long. Okay. Well, um, yeah, I need some copper, as you can tell here. Uh, so, you know... That's what happened, guys. I, I didn't have a place to spawn. I spawned out in the middle of nowhere, and I had to run back. It was a nightmare. I, was, I died repeatedly. I eventually got back to where I was. Uh, my bag was gone, um, but there's two things I could have done to help this situation. Number one, obviously, put down a... Um, and this is an obvious thing that you guys probably... Kids, duh, you know? Um, put down a... A place for you to self to spawn. Assume you're going to die, you know? And put down um, something, you know where you can spawn somewhere, right? Number two, have, a, have some kind of vessel, whether it's a small vessel or a hover vessel, mine's gonna be a small vessel, have a backup so you can go out there and fly. Your bag does not last for that long, right? Oh, we gotta, hold on. I gotta get out of here. Freaking drones coming in. All right. All right, we gotta get back to base. So where is base? Base is right there. Actually says base, right? Yep, there it is. Okay, so let's get back to base. Anyway, um, so yeah, uh, make sure you have a, a backup vehicle of some kind, small vessel, hover vessel, tank, capital vessel, whatever. Have something to back yourself up because your 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 bag doesn't last that long. And I lost my bag because I didn't have some. I didn't have anything to back me up. You know, I deserved what I got. I deserved what I got. Um, I was arrogant. And I didn't think I would die, and I didn't put anything down, and I paid the price. So, um, you know, learn from me, guys. Learn from me. So what are we going to do today? We're going to be picking up the pieces, all right? Um, I, when I get back, I'm going to show you what I've done. And um, I haven't done any building or anything, but I have done... I've done a little bit, actually. Uh, and I've also... What else did I do? Oh, yeah, I, I made all my gear again. I made my I made my guns. I made my tools. Everything's back. I think the only thing I'm missing is a multi-tool. Um, and then I'm, you know, back to where I was. Uh, and then today we're going to be working on the base. Now, there's a lot of things I want to do, guys. There's a lot of things I want to do. Another thing I did on stream, um, it, because I wanted to test it out to see how it would go. Please don't go in the water. There we go. Because I wanted to test it out to see how it would go. And I'll, I'll take you guys as well. Maybe even this video. We'll see how things go. Um, but I did go to the moon without an EVA, and I was fine. Um, space is super cold, and the moon is also cold, but it's good enough with heavy armor where I was not taking damage and I could be out of my ship. Okay, so I did go to the moon. I grabbed a little bit of magnesium, but not a lot because we're going to go back together. Um, I didn't even like going without you guys, but I wanted to test it out before video because, um, you know, I don't know. If I, if I go to the moon and things go wrong, it's just a lot of wasted time, and I don't want to waste you guys' time. So, and we'll go back to the moon together. Um, I might, again, I might even do it this video. You know what? I'll probably do it this video. Um, so we'll see about that. Anyway, I also want to make a deconstructor. Um, I want to I want to go to the the Titan parts that I found. Now, a lot of these quests told me to go to the Titan parts, like the uh, um, the Titan back, the Titan front, all that stuff. But I find the quest to be a little bit buggy. And I'm going to go, like, I'm going to set up the quest that tells me to go to the get Titan parts. And if it doesn't work, I'm just going to move along. I'm not even going to bother with the quest because um, they seem kind of buggy. And, I, you know, I don't want to be troubleshooting, you know. I just want to play the game. Um, let's see which actually one tells us. That's got to be solo mission, right? Uh, 
Let's go. Let's see what that does. I thought it was solo mission that was telling me to go check out the Titan parts, but we'll have to see about that. So you know what, guys? The game just made the decision for me. Um, you know, uh, I was thinking about going to the moon. I forgot. I don't have a small vessel anymore. So uh, that's why we went to get the copper. I was out of copper, and I need some more uh, for, this, for the you know small vessel. And not only that, but I'm going to make two small vessels. Because, like I said, make a backup one. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be working on the base today. That should be a lot of fun. It's kind of what I wanted to do anyway. Um, let's see. What do we need for the small vessel? Let's go to output. And that's not output. That's not output. That's output. All right, so we're gonna take this and this and this and that and a little bit of this, a little bit of that. We can't hold anything. Uh, well, we don't really need to hold that. So that will be fine. So let's go right here. And um, I picked a different small vessel this time because I want to do it a little differently. And um, how much copper are we gonna need? Uh, that's probably gonna be a bit much. There we go. Wow, look at that, only one over. Huh, didn't even pay attention to it. All right, we're gonna need to get some substrate as well, some uh, carbon substrate stuff. Let's put this where it goes in the, in the input. I've got these somewhat organized with the ingots. Um, oh, I also made an EVA boost. You guys told me I could make an EVA boost. And, uh, well, God darn it if you guys weren't right. You're always right. Why are you guys always right, man? Can't you be wrong sometimes, please? For me? Come on. Do it for old cage. Be wrong. All right, so let's go ahead and take the stone dust. I don't remember what the hell I needed the stone dust for. Um, but we're going to put that in. Let's go to base and let's go to input. We're just going to throw that in the input. I need it for something. Damn, seriously, what do I need that for? Oh, well, we're not going to worry about it too much. Um, oh, also, I put down a water purifier, and I think I did that on stream. Because um, I really, really needed water. So we'll go ahead and check that out as well at some point. Um, yeah, so let's get that carbon carbonite stuff, whatever the hell it's called. Uh, it's not in the output. Is it a miscellaneous? That shouldn't be a miscellaneous. Uh, that stuff all looks pretty good for miscellaneous. It's supposed to be an input. Well, I'm already in input. Okay, so let's go to player. And now let's go to input. Fridge and input. There we go. Um, I forget what it looks. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I got a lot of that stuff. I got a lot of that stuff. There we go. Oh, wow. Wait, what? Oh, okay. There we go. Now we're good. Start production. This is going to take like 20 minutes. That's why we're not going to have it today. Um, but that is all right, guys. That is all right. You know, like I said, man. You don't respect these games, you pay the price, and, and I got what I deserved. I mean, I didn't feel like that at the time. At the time, I'm not going to lie, I was pretty ragey, but, <laughs> oh boy. But, you know, that's just, uh, it comes with the territory for me. I'm ragey about everything, you know? So, if, if, my, if the store doesn't have what I want, I get, I get, I like, want to freak out and, like, start overturning, you know, display cases and stuff. So, it is what it is. All right, so there we go. Put that right there. No? How about over here? Yeah, that'll work. Okay. And you put this over here, and then if you hold down control, you can really bring this out quite a bit. There we go. Looking good. Looking good. All right, so what's the next thing we want to do? First of all, let's put this away. Let's come over here. Let's go to uh, output. Drag this down here. There we go. And bring this out. Okay, so this is going to be... Now, you can make this all different kinds of sizes. What is that? That's a five, right? I think I want a seven wide. Yep, that's what I wanted. Should I just put it down? Oh, look at that. You can make, like, really different looking ones. So it's a ten by nine. Is there any other sevens? No. So that's a seven. That's, that's pretty good. All right. F forget it. Let's put it down. There we go. We got to... We got a hangar door, people, and I put it in the wrong spot because I'm so freaking smart. Um, okay, well, I was so excited, and I put it in the wrong spot. It doesn't matter. Retrieve blocks, 1,100 hit points. Doesn't mean nothing. Let's take this thing down. All right, so, yeah, I didn't want I didn't want the uh, the building to, like, you go right in, and then all of a sudden you're just, like, going down a ramp. I kind of wanted to uh, space out here as well. As a matter of fact, um, no, no, Cage, no, you had this all planned out. All right, so I had this all planned out in my head. So, all right, so that's four. One, two, three, four. Never go, never go even. There we go. All right, so that'll work. So we'll do the same thing on the other side. Yeah, yeah, that'll work. You'll see. You guys will see. And then you'll be like, good job, Cage. Good job, bro. All right, so let's go ahead and use this thing and flatten this out a little bit more. We're not using the flattening thing. We could use the flattening setting. But it's not really what I want to do right now. So we're going to take this out like so. 
And it kind of just, uh... Yeah, that'll work. we come up here, hit number one twice. And then we're just going to bring this out a lot more. Like, a lot more. There we go. Looking good. Okay, so now we're going to bring this seven spots. One. I should probably do this not in the drone, because the drone just handles like ass. There we go. One, two, three. Well, what am I doing this for? Let's just put the damn thing down. Right? That would go into... Where did it go? Output, right? Uh, input? Where did the, um... Where did the who's he? What's the thing about Bob go? You know the um the 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 hanger. That is so weird. Output. Where's mis miscellaneous? It's gotta go with miscellaneous, right? Yeah, yeah, it went in miscellaneous. Okay. All right. So I'm gonna put one of these on each side. Do I want to have? Oh, I'm really getting. Yeah, I'm really going far with this build now. I'm I'm building it in my brain, and I'm like, yeah, we could do that. Yeah, then we could do that. And I'm like, oh my god, it's gonna take so long. Um, no, whatever. It's okay. Go big or go home. That's what I always say. And just for a little bit of, uh, structural... Let's take a look at what that looks like with, uh, structural integrity. Eh, it doesn't even look that bad, honestly, but still, might as well give it a little bit more... A little bit more SI, as I like to call it. Okay. So that looks good. Okay, so now we'll have that right there. That'll be an open spot. So we're gonna bring this over here as well. Um, so I'm thinking... One... Two, three, four, four, five. I don't know why this is. I don't know why that went down. There we go. And retreat block. Come on. Okay. All right. So is that five spots? Right, it looks like it looks like that's five spots. Nope. There we go. One, one. Maybe like that. Yeah. So one, two, three, four. Five and then the there we go. So that'll be um we'll have the hanger five spots and then maybe I'll even put a double hanger in there for like ultimate protection. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I'm really worrying too much about this, but that's you know that's how I do things. Okay. So let's go ahead and put this down, and like so. Come on, rotate. Oh, wrong button. Wrong game. There we go. Okay, much better. Much better. I like it. Now, should we have it go out one or just straight across? I'm going to have it go out one. Uh, what is that? That's seven? Eh, if it goes out one, it's not going to match up with the other side. All right, guys. I think I got it the way I want it. Let's take a look. It's a little square, but we're going to kind of, you know, do something about that at a later date. Um, but, yeah, this is the basic idea. And um, I was, I'm going to do a mirror version on this side at some point. I just don't know when. And then it'll just be like two areas to come in. And then you'll... you'll. Oops. Oh, that's weird. I didn't even hit F5. I don't know how that happened. Anyway, <laughs> so you come over here and then you'll just uh, go down into the base. I think this will be a nice little setup here. Nice setup. Um, full disclosure, this thing went poof. I don't know what happened to it. It was I was going I put it down. I was doing some work, and then the thing just went poof. Um, so that was not my fault, and I'm not about to waste resources on a bug. So I full disclosure, I spawned in another um, another hangar. So because it should not have gone anywhere because I didn't do anything to make it go anywhere. So I just wanted to let you guys know that full disclosure. You know, um, just so you guys know, just so you guys know what the deal is. All right, so let's continue working, shall we? All right, so we're gonna come on over here. We're gonna go like this, one, one, and then keep putting these in. All right, so I guess we'll just, uh, I guess we'll just close this up, like, and then we'll do the other part at a later date. I'm, I'm thinking that, like, I know myself, and I'm like, Cage, you're getting lazy. You're not gonna do the other part. I will. It's just I can't do it right now because it's simply, um, it's simply gonna take too much time. So, uh, also, what we're gonna do is we're gonna come in here. We're gonna go to uh, input. Go right here, and we're going to make some more blocks. Well, guys, I screwed that right the hell up. <laughs> Unfortunately, you didn't have to sit around waiting for my mistake to be rectified. Um, I was supposed to make the above ground part of the base out of metal. So let's take a look at what we could use with metal. Um, we'll go right here. That's there. Uh, and then we'll go right here. All right, so there we go. So we've got carbon crap. We've got wood crap. We've got concrete, which is nice. I'm going to use the concrete underneath the base. 
Um, the armored concrete is pretty good too, but I, I'm, I'm not going to use that. Um, I'm going to use right here the steel blocks. And then after that, you have hardened steel, but, I, you know, hopefully I don't need that. If I need hardened steel, that's going to suck. But, um, yeah, I'm just going to use steel blocks. It's just eating up all of my iron, unfortunately. But I really wanted to make this base out of iron. Now, you may think, well, why? What does it matter? Um, the, the thing is, you can, um, when you texture the base, right, uh, you can, hold on one second. Uh, steel blocks. Yeah, there we go. Why isn't that? There we go. Um, yeah, when you texture the base, uh, different materials have different, you know, textures. And I've been, I've been, you know, using, um, I've been working with, uh, with stone for so long, the concrete, because it's, it's just so damn cheap. I mean, you know, um, and this is going to eat up all my iron, but I want to use it because I haven't used it in a while. And I, and I want to see the, uh, the different textures, you know, um, and I don't know what I'm going to do with the floor. I might leave the floor concrete. It depends. Uh, originally, I was like, no, nah, I'm going to make the floor iron too. But, man, it's really eating up my iron. <laughs> uh, but I do kind of want to make everything above the base. I want to be made out of iron. Everything below wants to be made out of concrete. That that was my that was my goal. Do we want to paint this thing as well? Mm, maybe. Maybe. We need a texture tool and a paint tool for that. Uh, maybe we'll do that. Oh, God. I could pick that up, no big deal. Okay, let's go up front. And uh, yeah, like I said, I think for now, I'm gonna leave the floor made out of stone. I think that kind of makes a little bit of sense, you know? And plus it'll save me some iron. So, okay, well, you know we should have left that as a door. Um, yeah, all right. All right, yeah, it's looking pretty badass, honestly. All right, now we're gonna round off the corners a little bit. I should have just not put these down, but whatever. I put him down as the building, and then, like, I, I knew I was going to pick him up, but I was like, yeah, screw it. I'll put him down anyway. All right, so, um, do you want to go rounded or edged? Mm, let's go rounded, because why the heck not? All right, so there we go, and boom. Nope, not out uh, here. Huh? That, um, that hold down the button feature is really nice, but sometimes it just doesn't work, and then it, it sucks. <laughs> when it works, it's nice. When it doesn't, it sucks. Who'd have thought, right? All right, so now we're going to come on over here and do the same thing. Uh, go right there, take this out, and let's round this off. And uh, when, I'm done, when I'm done with this, I'm going to go ahead and make a texture tool and a, um, and a paint tool. So that will be wonderful. Let's go. There we go. And... Nope. Yes. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. I don't know what I'm going to do with the roof just yet. Um, so let's go ahead and go right here. And did I spec into those things? I don't... Yeah, I did. I did. The, the paint tool and the texture tool. I'm pretty sure I did. All right. So there... Uh, I think they'd be in here, right? Yep. They look like pistols. Um... There they go, right in the beginning. All right, so we're going to stop that. Because we're out of iron. Ah, freaking iron. Freaking metal, right? Got to get those auto turrets. I think next video, um, we're probably going to make a beeline for auto turrets. I've got some ideas. Um, some people said that you could get uh, auto turrets. Basically, i got to do the Titan Rex. And what you could do is you can um, take apart things on the Titan Rex, put them in the deconstructor or something. I'm not really sure what I'm going to get off the Titan Rex, but we're going to do some Titan Rex. And I'm hope hopefully I'll find some good stuff too. Um, and then we're going to hopefully be able to make an advanced constructor. That's what we need. We need the advanced constructor. So let's go ahead and grab our tools. Here we go. And throw those down there. And then get out of this and go to number six. All right, texture and symbols. Okay, so if we if we if we look at the concrete, it'll give us texture and symbols based off the concrete. If we look at the iron, it'll give us textures based off the iron. Let's do the floor first. Let's see if I can find a texture that I will like as the floor. All right, guys, I got something I like, but I would like to pass the night so you guys can see it in the bright morning. There we go. And as you can tell, this base needs a name. Okay, um, I need a name. It's got to be equal to that to that up there. Uh, it's got to have. Um, it's got to be two words. <laughs> well, actually, whatever. As long as it fits in there properly over the doorway, I don't really care. Um, two four-letter words would be fine. Um, need name. If you guys give me two four-letter words uh, for this base um, for a name, that would be wonderful. 
Um, I'm also going to show you how I did something here that I figured out that I think you're going to want to know about. Um, probably some of you already know, some of you don't, but I'm going to show you anyway because it's important. Okay, so when I was painting the... Um, uh, or not painting, but when I was uh, picking textures for this thing, I like this one right here, right? Right? But the thing is... Um, Normally, I could only get the... See the little light thing? I wanted the light thing on that side, right? Because if I do the light here, it'll only go down or to the right, right? So see here? It only goes down and to the right. Now, I liked it here because I wanted the light on the right side, right? Um, so I think that looked pretty good. But the thing is, I could not get the light to go where I wanted to, you know? I wanted this light to be on this side, on this side of the door. And as you can see, I did figure out a way to do it. Now, how did I do it? Well, this is how I did it. Um, you go to your multi-tool and you pick uh, change rotation and you can rotate the blocks. That's how you do it. All right. It's driving me nuts. But I, I, like, the way it, I like the way it came out. So let's go ahead and finish it. Um, what was the other one I was using? It was this, right? Yeah. There we go. Now, if you wanted these to go sideways, you just hit it again. Does it look better sideways? You know, it kind of does. It kind of does. I like it better sideways. All right. Now, do we want to do anything different here? We could have it just go like that all the way around. Um, what about on top? Yeah, top. Okay, yeah, yeah. So that'll be like that and like that. Hmm. I don't like the way the need name is uh, going to um, into areas that are not the same blocks. But I don't think it really matters, probably. Um... I just don't know if I want to do something different on the side here. Uh, maybe. We'll see. There we go. Alright. There you go. Might put some other things in there. But for now, um, that'll do. Maybe I'll put some uh, decorations in there somewhere. Like that. I don't know. Like that. Maybe to break up the uh, the sides. I don't know. Or um, I could pick something like uh, this. I won't pick that, but look at that. Isn't that... How freaking awesome is that? Um, I'll use that, but not for this kind of thing. You could also do green. Right? Freaking badass. Oh, love this game. Uh, what about this? Shut up, timer. No, I don't like that either. Um, Maybe something like this? Maybe. Maybe. It definitely looks futuristic. So let's do it on this side as well. I might change any of this, guys. <laughs> you know, I'm like a weather vane, you know? Like, sometimes I like this, sometimes I like that, and I might change my mind the next day. So, we'll see. Alright, so now we have to paint it. Alright, so what are we going to go for here? Now, I like black and red. Should we just say screw it and go for black and red? I don't know. Maybe. Um, black and red is kind of loud. Hey, how'd that jerk get in there? Oh, well. Uh, black and red is kind of loud. How about blue and white? I do like blue and white in these games. Um, space. That says blue and white to me. Now, should I go with that blue? Yeah, I kind of like the lighter blue better. It's just kind of... I don't know. It's a little bright. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do that like that, and then I'm going to uh, I'm going to grab this and I'm going to do that up there. Yeah, yeah. If the name, whatever, if whatever name you guys give me uh, f is f two four letter words, then that's that's going to work out just perfectly there. There we go. And we'll probably make these blue as well, and then we'll put white on the rest. I don't know. Maybe even um. Maybe even this. Yeah. Yeah, I'd probably put some windows there too. Definitely need a door. We definitely need a door there. There we go. Um, so where do I want to put the door? See, that's going to be a problem. Maybe I don't... You know what? I don't think I want to put the door right there. Look at this jerk. You're going to come in here and mess with me? That's what you get. That's what you get when you come in here. Tell your friends. Oh, wait, you can't. No, maybe I'll put the door over here. Yeah, I'll put the door over there. I think that's it for the entrance. I kind of like it. I kind of like it. I don't love it, but it's growing on me. There we go. All right, guys. Well, that's the entrance. My timer went off a while ago, so we're going to have to call this one here. What are we going to do next episode? Guys, 
we could do some quests. We could go find Titan parts. As you can see right here I've, on the on the right-hand side, I do have the uh, quest up that wants me to go visit the Titan parts. So I think we'll do quests and get Titan parts. Um, I also need deconstructors. And I need to figure out what I need for the deconstructors. I'm going to do that in between videos because, um, you know, I got to look into that. Uh, or we could go to the moon and get some magnesium. Or we could do both. I don't know. Um, I never know what I'm going to do the next day, you know, from one day to the next. But I, if, if I was making the next video right now, it would be go and look for the Titan parts. So anyway, guys, if you end up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. And I didn't show you what I'm going to do with the, with the floor. There you go. That's what I'm going to do with the floor. It's just going to be that. What am I going to color it as? I should probably know this before we end the video. All right. Hold on. Put a hold on the ending. Um, let's go to medium. There we go. Okay. Once, yeah, let's put a hold on this ending. I want to make sure this thing's ready. Because I'm going to take a nice old screenshot. Ah, I painted the freaking thing. All right. Well, that should be easy enough to repair. All right. So let's go. What was that? That was, um, it was page one, right? No, it was page two. Oh, no! Cage! Damn, I hate you. All right, guys. I think we're done with this one. It's pretty cool. I got these little yellow line thingies here. Those are in the symbols thing. See? Got a lot of stuff for symbols, right? Uh, maybe we could put something right in the middle of the word for our headquarters. Which one do you think would say headquarters the most? I don't know. None of these really say headquarters for me. Um, it's not bad. Skulls. I, I used to name some of my characters Skulls uh, in some of the games I played, so... He just looks sad, though. And this one just looks weird. And this one looks like an alien one. I don't know. Um, maybe you should go with this. That's pretty cool. Yeah! Actually, that looks really nice. Alright, guys, we need a name for this. This thing's awesome. Alright, let me do my outro again. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.